can just observing something really change reality? There's a simple experiment that shook the entire scientific community. This is part two of the famous double slit experiment. In this experiment, we fire electrons or photons toward a barrier that has two slits. Naturally, you'd expect the particles to pass through and form two bright bands on the screen behind, one for each slit. But what actually happens is completely unexpected. Instead of just two bands, multiple bands appear on the screen. Why? To find out, scientists place detectors near the slits to observe which slit the electrons were passing through. And suddenly, the interference vanished. Only two bands appeared, just like you'd expect from simple particles. But the moment the detectors were removed, multiple bands returned. In short, when observed we get two bands. When not observed we get multiple bands. No matter how many times this experiment is repeated, the results are always the same. This experiment showed that the reason for the multiple bands was the wave-like nature of electrons, creating an interference pattern that produces more than two bands. Quantum particles like electrons or photons have a dual nature. They're both particles and waves. Quantum mechanics says, as long as no one is observing, they behave like waves. But the moment you observe them, their wave state collapses and they become particles. But now imagine this. What if you delay your observation? What if instead of observing before they enter the slits, you wait and observe after they've passed through? This is the idea behind the delayed observation, also known as the delayed choice experiment. Earlier, when we observed the electron before the slit, it changed its behavior. But now, if we observe it after it passes the slit, logically, the electron should have already decided how to behave at the screen. If it didn't know it was being watched, it should behave like a wave, and we should see multiple bands. But when the experiment was done this way, the electron passed through the slits, hit the screen. Shockingly, only two bands appeared. The electron behaved like a particle, not a wave. But how is that possible? The observation was delayed. Yet the electron behaved as if it knew in advance that it would be observed. This result left scientists speechless. It's almost as if the electron, after reaching the screen, looked back in time, realized it was being observed, and changed its behavior retroactively from a wave to a particle. And to this day, no better explanation has been found. So what does this mean? Can particles somehow influence their past? Can observation alone change reality? Do quantum particles somehow time travel? Because every outcome of this experiment seems to point in that direction.